<laughs> What's up everybody? Welcome to the next video and today we are taking you on our annual fishing trip. It's camping, it's living in the woods, it's a fishing tournament in which I usually end up winning. Uh, but here it is, we got the boat hooked up, we got the gear set. Last couple stops to pick up some drinks, pick up some ice, and we're gonna be out of here. So let's hit the road. Where are you headed to? Uh, Martini Lake chain, so no walleye really anyways, but... Martini Lake? Yeah. Yeah, I know where that the, is. Well, so it's a chain of lakes, there's like top and big Evans, and lower Evans. Get a pontoon, go out with four coolers. Yeah. One of them is full of food. Yeah. The other one, they fill the whole, all of them full of fish. Really? And they, they didn't care what size the fish was. Yeah. So, you know, anywhere from that, bluegill, you know, like that, up to like that. Yep. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Good luck. This is it. There's an island in the middle. We're going to boat out there, but it's just beautiful right here. We're going to load the stuff up. We're going to boat over to the island. We're going to get set up and then just a few days of no water, no electricity, no people, just fishing. Friends, it's going to be a great time. So let's get loaded up. All right, Gabe, how you feeling about this year? Champ right here. Champ, he calls it early. Champ. Uh, we'll see what happens. Hold on, here. take a picture Go of this. Fingers. How he's pumping that. Look at this thumb. <laughs> what do you do? I have more strength than my thumb when I use because I have hitchhiker's thumb. It's got a wicked bend, so you just that's kind of painful. It's just easier if I do that. I have more power, more grip. Jason's from the gorilla family. <laughs> I think. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, it's off. And this is where you always have to wonder if Jason put the boat plug in or if this whole thing's going underwater. <laughs> or, never know. Jason's zooming across the lake here right now. Come pick me up. It takes a couple of trips to get everything out there. But, you know, as I stand here and I look around, we've been coming here for, I think, 20 years coming up to this just it's just like a paradise of wild game and beautiful landscapes and water and fishing and um it's just i've been coming here for so long it's just so amazing uh, to have something that's such a tradition and coming here with these guys and uh it's just been uh, something special that i don't think everybody gets so yeah it's gonna be an awesome weekend here comes jason Oh, uh, yeah, I'm not sure where the dog came from. Huh. That's a that's a new one. You want the bloody bandaged finger? <sighs> Last year, my buddy Levi and I thought it would be cool to bring our, our sons out for the first time. Big camping trip, first time going out to the island, it'd be really cool. So then we thought it'd be really neat to bury some treasure for them. And so right here where I stand, we got like an old ammo canister and we threw all sorts of like pocket knives and just cool stuff that 10 year old boys would think is awesome. So hopefully later this summer, we'll come out with the boys uh, and right here in this spot, they'll dig for buried treasure. <laughs> That's pretty sweet. Jason, all right, buddy, here we go. Look, <laughs> it's probably, yeah, terribly overexposed. Hang on. <laughs> is... All right, no, you were supposed to hang on to it for the video. So we had two. I thought you were. All right, here we go. First fish of the tournament for me. Jason just had one in the boat too. I told him, hey, don't throw it back yet. We'll get a video, but he didn't listen. What? 2.2 pounds on the board, but I think I'm still behind. Jason, how you feeling? 2.2 pounds. 
pretty good, pretty good. We're catching good. fish and that's what matters. All right, Gabe is behind me. Everybody's on the board. And here you go, little fishy. This is the weirdest way I've ever put a fish back and tried to film. There we go. Woohoo! That's a good one, Gabe. Let's see her. All right, morning, Jason. How are we morning. feeling about day one tournament? Good, good. We're all kind of neck and neck with each other. Makes for a good, uh, good tournament. Be fun. Uh, it's a little hazy out and cool, but not too windy, and that's uh, that's good. So. Yeah, the wind was a little, yeah, a little rough last night. Yeah. Got any uh, camp crafting in mind this mm. afternoon? I'd love to see a good camp craft. I don't know. There's a, there's a sweet cedar log out in the woods there that's oh, yeah. asking to be made into something. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe another mallet. Mallets are fun. I haven't made a mallet in a while. I could use a new mallet. Yeah. My, my mallet in the shop that I use that I made up here is made out of ash, and so it's really hard. A cedar mallet would be nice because it's soft and forgiving. Hmm. So you can wail on things without damaging them. <laughs> so maybe I'll do that. Gabe, our current leader. Um, I, I told you. I told you how it was gonna go. Uh, that you're Day gonna one. take an early lead and then give it up like you always do. That's usually what I do. <laughs> it might be. It might be different this year. I'm gonna try to get some medium format landscapes, a little just misty and not very nice this morning. Second day we're here, but the sun's gonna poke out later. There's just a lot of beautiful areas up here, so I think we'll, I think we'll have a chance to get some cool stuff. Sunsets or sunrise tomorrow or just, just some wide open landscapes with big lakes and trees, so I don't know, we'll see. Always fun shooting medium format. Uh, Jason, thanks for slamming on the brakes. Not telling anybody. There's no brakes on a boat. You think there are fish here? I sure hope so. Alright, Gabe said he's catching one right now. Gabe, if this wasn't digital, I wouldn't waste the film on what you're doing right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here for you to be up here. I'm here. I, I'm not excited to be around you guys, but I am excited to be in the great outdoors. Well, I'm glad you suck at fishing, so it <laughs> makes the tournament easy. I. Uh, How come you were late? I historically have sucked on this trip the last couple of years. How long has it been since you won the tournament? I think. Uh, I think it's only been one year. I think I handed it to you last year. Oh yeah, you did. Yeah, yeah. that's not that bad. So, it's not that bad. But last year I caught two fish in uh, four days. So. Levi likes to down. No, it wasn't that bad. I was caught it? two fish last oh, year. Yeah. Damn. I think Ben caught one or two. Yeah, that was pretty bad. Levi likes so. to downplay his potential winning. <laughs> All right, here I'm we gonna, go. I'm gonna sit and kick. All right, I like it. Yeah. Not mad about that. All right.
All right, Gabe. Uh, I need a big day. You need a big day, don't you? I had a really crappy Friday. It was not a solid fishing night no. for you, no. So I'm gonna get a picture of this island over here, and I took the same picture maybe, I don't know, 10 or 12 years ago, but the camera was old, and it's hard to get up the fog coming in to capture this island, so now's my chance to recapture it in medium format. It's a little tricky with a boat moving. New one. All right, sweet, there it is. Ooh, satisfying every time, Gabe. I use my phone as a light meter, so there's, for, I don't know, for people that don't know, this is all manual. There's nothing that tells you anything. You have to set it all. You have to do the work. Unusual in this world today. <laughs> Put some effort into it. Uh, so I just have a basic light meter on my phone. It tells me kind of how to set the camera. This camera's tricky because when you look in this viewfinder, I don't know if you can see this. Can you see that in there, Gabe? Mm -hmm. um, everything's backwards. So when you move right, it moves left. Or down is up, and so it's really kind of disorienting. It's a little tricky. Cool. See how those turn out? Oh, the sun's right behind me. That's okay. There we go. Uh, that's cool. There are loons all over up here. They're beautiful. I love loons. They're just, they're gorgeous ducks, birds, animals, whatever you want to call them. Uh, and they make just the coolest sound and you can hear them all day up here just calling back and forth and they nest up here. In fact, just over here there's a nest. I'll try to get some shots of it later, but he let me get pretty close as we're trawling across the lake and, and they're just beautiful. I just love loons. So there you go. Jason. Mm -hmm. One to ten, you have to wear this bracelet for the rest of the camping trip. Okay. All right. Uh, one, two, three, six. Four. Mm -hmm. Still like calm and just nice out. Six twenty twenty one. I guess it hasn't been too long. It's been too long. I just wanted to sing a Zach Bryan song. It hasn't been fifteen years. It hasn't been fifteen years. <laughs> what am I gonna say? Here you go. Rat bastard. Yeah. Take a picture of us like and then me on my knees crying. Give it back. Give it back. Alright, congratulations, Casey. Thank Winter, you. Twenty twenty four Island Classic. Congratulations. Thank you. Feels good. Sorry, Gabe. <laughs> Maybe next year. Maybe next year. All right. I'm gonna kiss the trophy. Ah, feels good. Number six. All right. Well, I think that's a wrap on this trip. We're packing up everything. Um, it's always a great time when we come up here. Just been coming up here for so long. It's always just great to get back up here and see the island and how it's changed and just have time to catch up and get together and do some fishing and it's a great time so hope you had a good time watching the video we'll see you next time oh almost forgot we always hit this great old diner on the way home pick up camp start to head home get filled up with a classic old small town diner can't beat it Ooh, some Zach Bryan. Yeah. That's it.